home free in Valentine's Day. What more could you ask for? Not much. We got Unchained Melody. I hope you guys are enjoying the content. If you are, let me know in the comments below. I'm looking forward to checking this out. Uh, I'm looking to see if it's going to be a heartfelt one, a joking one, a not joking one. I, uh, you know, who knows? If you have, if you want interested in more Valentine's Day music, check out the new track I just released. Actually, I've been working on it on the live streams. It is a Valentine's Day love song because I am quite the romantic. <laughs> Let's see what we got. Also, if you've not followed me on Instagram, I'm giving away a thousand dollars to people following me on Instagram uh, by March 15th. Just give it what all you have to do is follow me on Instagram and you can be entered to win a hundred bucks. Ten people are getting a hundred bucks. Oh my love. Dude, this is my Colorado. darling, I've hungered for your touch. A long, lonely time. Well, I just want to show something really quick. Let me rewind this really quick. If you look back at that first note, it's amazing how you can manipulate voice and how they manipulate the voice to give this kind of uh, way you can add attack or reduce attack to the uh, initial onset of the note. Attack is is how fast the the the, full, the note is heard. So, for example, or the fullness, the full volume of the note is heard. Actually, is the the real uh, definition. So, for example, like an, uh, like a fast attack would be like a hey, but a slow attack would even or even even if it was a long note, like you still have a hey or hey, you know, like just a long thing. It's supposed to like hey, hey. See how it's swerving in versus just a fast attack? An example, another example would be like a cello, um, which has a slower attack versus like a snare drum. The transient is way more towards the beginning as a start of the sound as opposed to like the more middle of like a, like a um, cello or violin would be. Uh, but it's amazing how like that first note, I was like, oh, is that a guitar? Because it had a, a strong attack. And then I obviously realized by the next notes that came in, it was not. I've Doesn't that sound like the start of a guitar right there? Hard attack, it's cool. Not a heart attack, a hard attack. Lonely time. Yeah, listen to that Tom roll. Come on, left and right. That's <laughs> dissonance in these chords. Yeah, you hear that flip? Come on, I call that, this is the perfect, actually, example, because, you know, it's Valentine's Day. Uh, I call it the dip in the strawberry and the chocolate move right there, that when you swing and, s like, just touch that note and dip your, dip that note right there. Listen to this. Oh, yeah, I love that. I'm 
those snaps or is that the beatboxing? How how they their their process of filming this stuff in the sense of like how long ago did they film it how, how long like was this this film in December or is this film like a week and a half ago I should have asked that when I when I interviewed them that that'd be a good question to know. Come on. Do they ever release a song without releasing a music video? Because I see right here they have 144 original music videos. That's phenomenal, man. Honestly, good for them. That is really, really cool. So I hope you guys are enjoying the content. Let me know in the comments below what you want to see more of. Thank you so much for watching. I'd love to know what you thought of this song and, uh, you know, anything I missed or didn't pick up on or any meanings or anything like that. So follow me on Instagram for a chance to win some money. I'm trying to grow that and to get more interviews actually is why I'm trying to grow it so I can you know, just continue to get more and more interviews. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. God bless and peace out. Happy Valentine's Day.